Hi, I'm Andrew Dodd from uh, MBUK Magazine, and what we're looking at here is the White Bikes 146X. Now, this is 150 mil travel front and rear. As you can see, it's quite a stealthy looking bike, pretty understated. The retail price to this is five grand complete, and if you do the math and you do the adding up on this, you got about £4,950 worth of spec on this alone. You've got £2,000 worth of Eastern Haven carbon wheels on there. You know, you've got Fox Kashima coated forks and shock. Eastern carbon bars up the front there, Eastern Haven stem, RockShox reverb post, Visit Gobi saddle. You've got a 1x10 setup on the front. It comes with a 32, 34 and a 36 tooth chainring. So it's, it's a really well thought out bike for UK sort of trail centre riding. Now the suspension platform on the back end of the 146 it is almost the beauty of the bike. It's a big boom style system using the quad link two linkages. So you've got two sets of linkages here, which are both made of carbon on this bike. Uh, they're incredibly light and it also allows uh, the shock to be quite low on the bike. Um, great for cornering, weight distribution and stuff. It's an incredibly active rear end, even though it's enhanced by the Kashima shock. And as you'll see on the footage, you can see this thing going crazy over the tiniest bumps, but it still manages to ramp up really nicely when you hit the big stuff. The sort of guys that want to do a couple of laps before lunch, maybe sling the saddle down, get the full face helmet on, hit the uplift in the afternoon. This is exactly the sort of bike you're looking for. It's stiff, it's light, it's unbelievably capable. Um, it's not quite as stiff as some of the other bikes, despite having a bolt through the rear end, but it's not necessarily a bad thing. It's got quite a lively, springy ride. This actually gives you a bit more grip and makes it a bit more playful. Uh, it's got a 66 degree head angle up on the front there, so it's nice and stable, good front centre, long wheelbase. Um, from my point of view, the only irritating thing is the fact there isn't an extra large currently. Uh, this is a large and I'm on, I'm on the absolute limits when I'm riding it. But um, as you can see, it's a very, very good bike. To find out more about the white 146X, check out the review in MBK next issue. If you've got an iPod, iPad, iPhone, etc., download Apple Newsstand and it's available there too.